Thanks for joining us on this Thursday night, everybody. It was quite a scene this morning in Salinas as thousands of people came together to remember Officer Jorge Alvarado Jr. and one organization made sure his family could be there together. KION's Erica Bratin spoke with the nonprofit Luke's Wings founder and CEO about their mission that helped fly in a few of Officer Alvarado's family members and friends to Salinas for that memorial. Erica. Phil, the news of Officer Alvarado's death not only shook the Central Coast community, it made headlines across the country. That's how Luke's Wings, a nonprofit based in Washington, D.C., heard about Salinas' fallen officer. Uh, when we find out about a fallen officer, we are trying to provide flights within hours of the attack. The organization provides free flights to reunite families of officers injured in the line of duty or those who made the ultimate sacrifice. Luke's Wings connected with a local agency to make sure Officer Alvarado's family and friends had the opportunity to be together no matter the distance. We provided a flight for his father from Nicaragua. We provided a flight for his nephew who was at basic training at Fort Benning. We provided flights for his battle buddies from the 101st Airborne and we provided flights for pretty much anybody who needed to get to the funeral. Luke's Wings donated 12 flights to Officer Alvarado's loved ones, including cousins and friends. The organization partners with four major airline carriers to provide these emergency flights. When there's a, an attack on a law enforcement officer, the first few hours are chaotic. There's noise and everybody is trying to help and the family is in shock. We're here with an unlimited number of airplane tickets. Luke's Wing's original mission was to connect families with wounded, ill and injured service members and veterans. In 2016, the organization expanded, adding a fallen officer's transportation assistance program. Officer Alvarado was a veteran. He was in the 101st Airborne and so not only does he qualify for our fallen officers transportation assistance program because he's a law enforcement officer, but he also qualifies for our program because he's a veteran. Gil adds sadly for their fallen officers program, they are doing more flights for funerals than for hospital visits. Luke's Wings wants people, especially those who have family in law enforcement, to know that they are only a phone call away, but hope that's a phone call they never have to make. We'll have that information on our website at KION546.com. Erica Bratin reporting for KION News Channel 546.